Hi, my name is Chiu Shu, a design engineer from IP and device software engineering in Altera Penang. Planning I.O. pins by considering pin placement rules in early in the design is very important. This video shows you a basic overview of pin planners feature in the Quarters 2. I'm opening up a Quarters project here. To launch the pin planner, in the menu bar, point to assignment and click pin planner. Current project device is shown at the top here. This is the package view which is the main window in the pin planner. It shows all the pins on the current device package. Different types of the pin have different symbols. To know each symbol pin type, click on the pin legend window here. This legend window will list all the pin symbol used in the current device. The red dot on the package corner shows the location of the first pin on the package. Click on the show differential pin pair connection in the left bar here. The red lines between two pins indicates that those are differential pair pins. By default, the Live I.O. Check feature is turned off. In the pin planner, click on the Live I.O. Check icon here. Now, the Live I.O. Check feature is enabled. I would like to make a pin assignment of the DQ pin. Let me filter the DQ pin. There are so many pins in the package view here and we need to make a legal placement on the DQ pin. In the task window, click the highlight pin. Search for DQ or DQS group under the memory pin. This is a by 8 group design and I will double click the by 8 DQ group. As you can see, all the related DQ or DQS group is highlighted in different color. Now, let me simply drag and drop one of the DQ pin to the DQ group in the package view. As you can see, the Quarters 2 software immediately checks whether your new pin related assignment passed the basic I.O. buffer rules. Now, you can click the Live I.O. check status from the View menu here to display the total numbers of error and warning for the pin assignment that had created. Now, let's start the I.O. assignment analysis command by clicking the icon here. When running this command, the fittest previous compilation results are all written. Any other results such as analysis and synthesis or timing analysis are not affected. Now we have done with the start I.O. assignment analysis. The suggested placement made by the analysis can be reviewed in the pin out file here. To accept the suggested pin location from the I.O. assignment analysis, I'm now going to back annotate to save the pin and device assignment into the setting files. To do that, point to the assignment in the menu bar, click the back annotate assignment. So let's back to the pin planner. As you can see, all the pin here have been back annotated. That's all for the video. Hope you like it. Thanks.